as the cameras recorded the arrival in Britain of the first pilotless plane to cross the Atlantic. An American Skymaster opened the age of push-button aviation. A mechanical brain and radar guided it on its 10-hour trip over 2,400 miles of the Atlantic. With Air Minister Noel Baker interviewing, here is Colonel Gillespie telling the story. I understand you've been working at it a long time. Uh, how long? The project has been underway a little over two years. That is the entire project of automatic flight and the things connected with it. And it's mostly not new gadgets. It's gadgets which you've adapted and put together. Leadership? Yes. A few things new and other, other old things definitely apply. And uh, when you've got it all ready, you put everything into it before you start. All the instructions go into your control. That's it, exactly. As I understand it. And then it just does itself all the way. That's it. And I hope you had all the help you needed at this end. We certainly did. We uh, cabled our request to uh, England as to just what equipment we wanted up and where. The Royal Air Force installed it, checked it, and it worked perfectly. The scientists claim the electric brain in industry could solve a nation's troubles. 